if you have pallets lying around uh, you can make use of it uh, for some garden projects uh, I'm going to be making a herb wall which is uh, keep this pallets vertical uh, and make use of its existing wood and shape to make boxes uh, at three le levels so I can use it to plant herbs so you can keep it close to your kitchen wall or somewhere away from direct sunlight but uh, somewhere that doesn't get very hot you now these pallets come in various shapes and sizes so um, you got to use your imagination as to how you're gonna proceed also you've got to get the wood out in a way that you don't crack it so you've got to look out for uh, nails which are bent on the other side uh, freeing them up would make it easy to open them up uh, and rip it off I've decided to put a roof on top. I'm just trying it out. So if I have to cover it during autumn and winter, I can just put some sort of a plastic or tarpaulin over it and just drop it to the side. So it'll just keep it uh, away from the elements. I put feet on the left and right. That way it's raised from the decking and also stop it, stops it from tipping over from the front on the back it's always going to be against a fence or a wall at least that's the plan I need to line the boxes we'll be lining the boxes and fill it with gravel and compost before I plant anything so far I've just got a coriander pot And this is the final result. I've ended up with the roof a little shorter than what I was initially going to do. Uh, also because of some feedback from the Home Minister. And that's that. Generally placing a pot to get an idea. That's the deep one. So this is the shallow one. Also managed to salvage and handle from an earlier wooden basket. So use a strip of metal hooked it in and makes it easy to carry so it would require shifting at some point so just prepping it and I have painted I had some leftover paint the paint I used for the door so I didn't have much of it so whatever I had I had a bit of an undercoat and uh, the paint or should I say overcoat and uh, there we go some degree of uh, protection so it can last longer hopefully uh, we'll see how it goes but uh, I'm very pleased with it plan is to tangle some lights over this if or some other kind of outdoorsy thingy not yet decided about Finally, I'm lining every box I'm going to carry on lining the other before filling it up and finally with a few plants in there it's in the process of uh, having more plants put in 
and then when I acquire them I don't think I'll grow them from seed for now as a it's probably a bit late in the season and it's already summer and I don't have the patience so for now I'll just slowly start uh, adding plants from a nursery or from the local store and uh, enjoy getting some warm grown herbs uh, pickings as time goes by well I've not included uh, the actual build because it's it's just too simple um, it took a little effort getting the slats out uh, but overall uh, this is just more of an idea of what you can do if you have uh, a pallet hanging around uh, I might have mentioned earlier in the video uh, I did have a pallet unfortunately I never got around to using it and uh, it uh, was four years or so just lying in the dirt in the mud and uh, it was beginning to rot so I did salvage a few bits from it which I've used as boards uh, to make the boxes but overall uh, the actual pallets I acquired from my neighbor who thankfully were just about to bring it and uh, while I caught them or else uh, I would have had to wait for some more time before I could acquire anything so, so yeah it's just an idea of what you can do uh, so I hope uh, Herb wall uh, using the pallet. I've got uh, use one whole pallet and uh, a donor pallet to take a few boards and pieces. Uh, but overall, you could probably get this work done in a single pallet, provided you don't crack them as you rip them off. I do have a spare pallet now, which I think I'll make uh, some sort of a shelving uh, so I can keep more pots uh, vertically make it you know, make it worth the sacrifice that uh, the tree went through uh, to give us this wood just uh, upscaling anyways thank you